So I've seen that there are a lot of really great team profiles on the public network. Um, there's a new feature come, that came out recently, Notebooks. Anything you want to share about that? Yeah, uh, we're super excited about this. Um, one of the things that we've been learning about as we've seen API adoption scale globally um, is the different types of ways that people want to interact with APIs. Mm -hmm. So everyone knows about Postman collections. This is a highly portable way of shipping an API, getting a view on an API, calling an API, the, you know, being able to uh, execute the documentation for an API. But um, it's difficult to read a collection like a narrative. You can't, you can't easily do storytelling around a collection. So um, we built Notebooks, which we launched uh, in this last week. And the idea there is you can take all the APIs you have on Postman, all the requests you've curated in your collections, and you can bring them into something more like a narrative. And there's different words you could use. Uh, you can call it an interactive article. You can think of it as a blog. But it's really a way to do storytelling around an API. There's different types of stories you want to tell. Maybe it's a launch announcement. And so the story you're telling is, look at, look at how you can actually use this API. And it's an end-to-end -end use case. Mm -hmm. Or maybe it's an example of how to combine two APIs from two different companies to do something bigger. Maybe it's a use case. It's reference material. It's onboarding material. It's very flexible. Um, but that's that need to do storytelling is 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 super common. And Outside of a notebook or outside of a collection, the only way you can do it is plain text, mm -hmm. which is something someone has to read and then they have to translate. Whereas with a notebook, the requests are there in line. You can authorize in line. Um, and so you're getting that Postman client experience inside of the narrative. So you're both learning and onboarding at the same time.